Our lovable mouse was always a busy man. He worked long and hard nights just to make those few extra bucks. Minnie had taken notice of this, eventually deciding to ask Mickey about it. Upon questioning him about his struggles, Mickey's patience had finally broke. He'd become irritated, lashing out, as he said horrible things to her. She tried her best to reason with him, but Mickey had none of it, slapping her out of pure anger. A heartbroken Minnie had run out of the room with tears streaming down her face. It wasn't long before Mickey had realized the severity of his actions. Filled with regret, he had tried to apologize, but Minnie was nowhere to be seen after that. The guilt-ridden mouse had stayed up all night until exhaustion had taken over. When Mickey had woken up from his deep slumber, he was quick to notice that the house was abnormally silent. No birds were chirping, no sounds of cars passing by, just pure silence. He ran outside as quick as he could, realizing there was only an empty street and a depressing gray sky. Mickey had walked far down the street, but it always seemed to be heading to the same place, as if it were looping. He grew more helpless as time passed. It all felt like a bad dream. Mickey tried to end his life many times, but despite his efforts, he just couldn't escape. For three months, he had been trapped here. His sanity had began to decrease. The isolation, the loneliness, he couldn't handle it anymore. Until... A small, blue-haired boy had approached him from seemingly out of nowhere, requesting to sing along with him. Mickey was confused nonetheless, but... What reason did he have to say no? Oh, 
on a Friday night yet. 